Okay, symbolizing an ArcGIS Pro. Um, what I'm looking at here are census blocks, and in the attribute table we have a population field and a population density field. And what we want to do is symbolize on population density. So apply some colors that increase in intensity as the density value increases. So if we go into the symbology for this layer, it's automatically drawn using a single symbol for all blocks. But we want to apply a graduated color. Graduated color will increase in intensity as the values increase. So the symbology window sometimes just collapses on you and you think, oh great, I'm done. But look at the range of values here, 0 to 1067. So let's check our population density field by sorting that descending, and our highest value is 106 people per, people per acre, I guess. So that's not right. If we sort the population field, which you wouldn't necessarily need to do because you've already determined that it's wrong, but now you can see that what's happened is it was the population field that was symbolized. So if we go back into the symbology for this layer, you can see that the field automatically populates, it autofills to the first numeric field that ARC finds in the table. And you have to change this. You have to choose, deliberately choose the field that you want to symbolize on.